the order of St. Augustine leaves this period of uh, the 75th anniversary of the Augustinian presence in Nigeria with great joy, happiness, and thanks given to God for the blessings he has showered upon the order, upon the province in Nigeria, and upon all those who labored in the past to make sure that the gospel message is spread in Nigeria, especially in the uh, Adamawa region. Three Augustinians left Ireland and London, two from Ireland actually, and one from London, to go to Nigeria, an unknown place, in order to preach the gospel. Since then, many other Augustinians followed in some uh, period of time. An Augustinian from uh, Spain joined in the mission. So this shows the union or the sign of communion among uh, Augustinians because the order basing her mission on the spirit of community life, of friendship, sharing what we have together with one another and living with one mind, one heart intent upon God. They unite together in order to sustain the various missions which Augustinians have in different circumscriptions of the order around the world. So, I would say the Kuria gives her full support to the Nigerian province, especially at this period in which, in the northern part of the country, the Augustinians are living in a very difficult situation. Christians there find it very difficult to witness, but with the presence of Augustinians and also together with the bishop and the diocesan priest and religious, that lightens the, uh, the, 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 the situation and makes light the, the fear, the tension that is being created. I know it's a very big challenge we have been told to sacrifice ourselves, take up our cross daily and follow Christ. And that is the price which Augustinians are paying, especially in Maiduguri, Kano, and uh, some parts of Kaduna where uh, there is tension. Augustinians, over the course of years, have been very generous and have been very dedicated to the cause of spreading the gospel message. The Irish Augustinians have given so much to the service of the church, to the growth of the church, and to the evangelization of the church in Nigeria. The English also have collaborated with the Irish in terms of bringing the gospel message to Nigeria. So the brothers in Nigeria are living this period <coughs> of 75th anniversary with great joy and recognition also to the Irish Augustinians who have labored, they sacrificed their lives. Unfortunately, some of them are not alive today to witness to what they have done in the past. However, some number of them are still alive and some of them will be going for the anniversary. We here in the Korea, we have been given our own support to the Nigerian province through the uh, assistance, especially in terms of crisis. The other one was in, in Meduguri when the church was burned. The Kuria mobilized the other circumscriptions to live, to share whatever they have through prayers, through material support, in order to sustain the presence of Augustinians in Maiduguri. Monetary assistance was given for the reconstruction of the church that, were, that, that was burned at some point. In Kaduna, a church was burned down, and some of uh, the, uh, the circumscriptions were informed, the prior general personally sent a letter to the provincial of Nigeria and his own assistance as a sign of the other's support, the other's closeness to the Nigerian province because Nigerian province is a young circumscription coming up and such they need the support of uh, the other. So at this time in which the Nigerian province is celebrating God's grace of abundance in Nigeria, the Kuria general is strongly behind them. Some of the brothers will definitely be there for the event, which will bring many Augustinians, especially uh, some of the Irish brothers, 
and even uh, some of the brothers from Ireland, uh, a superior from Italy, will hopefully be there, and some other Augustinians who have indicated interest in order to participate in this event. This will be a sign of the visible union, the visible <coughs> unity and brotherhood among the Augustinians. So we hope to consolidate the Augustinian presence in Nigeria.